labor, and the expression of worth. Down here in this tunnel, playing, and there was a family that walked by. They lingered for a while, listening from afar, and there was a young lady there, and I sensed that she was listening in, and my heart had intention you know, of just sharing the joy and the love of music as it as it went across across the channel. You know, there's this channel between us at times, but we can send that love outward. It is a choice. We can choose to enrich the world, enrich one another. We can choose to bless one another, to help, to hold, to care for one one another. Not because we are naive, but because we choose love because we are servants of the light, of the way, of the truth, of the life, all of us, yes. So I didn't have any friends and I was kind of a shy kid, so um, instead of eating lunch, I'd go to the library and read books about composers' lives because it was interesting stuff. They're kind of weird people. One of the stories was about Bach. I was reading up on Bach and he wanted to study with an organist that was like 250 miles away. So he walked there, but he didn't, have, you know, it was winter and he didn't, he was poor. He didn't have enough money to even really make the trip and with food. And, and he was starving to death and he, and he was walking through this alley behind this restaurant and someone came to the back door and threw a, a bucket of fish heads out on the ground behind it, just to you know, throw it out. And he was so hungry, he got, started chewing the meat off the fish heads to survive, you know? And like, he bit down on something hard and he took it out of his mouth and it was a piece of gold. And he had enough money to go in there and have like a huge meal and like have change left over. And like, you know, the mystery behind that is out there. I don't know who put the gold in the fish head. L-N-T-E-O-W. I feel the way yeah. that my fingers move. Da, 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 da. It is. It, it is that chord progression that, that medley. Those kids made that medley on. Move. Like a, a, what's that Journey song? A, a, and he had a sword fight with Handel and like they were like literally trying to kill each other and then I think Bach um, or no I, mean, I, I can't remember which one, but one of them like you know um, lunged at, at the other and it got snagged on one of the buttons and actually broke snapped the sword and they were like and so they quit fighting and like had a good laugh and went and got drunk because it was over a woman or something. And they were good, they were good friends and then they, you know, kind of woman thing happened. Push away from these things, you know this. We're musical. You know this. You know this. The Rucker Brothers is musical. <laughs> Dude, that's like crazy. Why do that's you something. keep sabotaging yourself? This is like the pick of destiny too much, man. Self. Self, 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 yeah, man. He's like, be coolly cool, boy. We'd be admitted to hospital if we did some shit. In my pocket. People would think we're on acid or schizophrenic on the two. One, two, three, four. Like me. That was a Ray Charles moment. Yeah, I think you're right about that. I didn't know he sang that song. Oh, you remember? Yo left, yo left, yo left, right left, yo left, yo left, you went left, right left. I went down to the catboard. Mary Airbrain. Matt was living with Watermelon Slim, I think he maybe 2004, 2005, and he introduced me to him. We got to play a gig with him once. And he, he was really a wonderful guy to hang out with. And just when I heard him play music, you could just sense the greatness. It was just this presence in the way that he played. I mean, we, I, I got to jam with him in the living room. It was, it was really quite amazing. At this gig, I think this is noteworthy. He, he got down on his knees when there was this, um, all the lottery tickets were, were dropped. And he just started helping pick up. I, I just always remember that about Watermelon Slim. Anyway, he recorded this album called Merry Air Breaks. Apparently he was the first Vietnam veteran to record a protest album. 
and there's some Woody Guthrie tunes on there, or at least one Woody Guthrie tune on there. It's it's a profound album, Mary Air Breaks. Uh, Bill Homan was his name back then. Now his name is Watermelon Slim. Franz Liszt um, was a child prodigy, and his parents uh, were concerned that he wasn't he was growing up too fast and didn't do normal kid things like go outside and play and go you know. And they took him to the beach to play with other kids, and he refused. He tried. He tried to play with them, but he was like, "They're not very smart. Can I practice now?" Yeah, and uh, his parents caught him with a, a straight razor, trying to cut the skin in between his fingers so he could reach just a little bit farther on the keyboard, you know. And this music is uh, kind of known uh, to piano players as like some of the most difficult music to play because of like you have to play like a, you know, thirteenth with like one hand, like you know. Ding. <laughs> like a Tom, Tom and Jerry thing where his pinky reaches like all the way to the other side of the keyboard by itself, you know? <laughs> Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's so good to be here with I mean, you. It's like, a, it's like having a drink of water after not yes. drinking anything for three years. For me. It deserves yeah, acknowledgement. I mean, I'm thanking God that we're both here together and we have a purpose. And, and, and so we're going to tend to that with everything that we have until we, until we see you know, we we do not know how things go, but we but but we know music, how to produce each other. I like that. I mean, we do, and we know. I remember how to you coaching me and producing room. me like on like my mandolin parts on like wholehearted. I was like, where where <laughs> the hell am I going at this damn song? <laughs> That's funny. Oh, how Because you know what I mean. It's like, whoa, whoa, uh, uh, what? Okay, oh. I don't know this instrument, so I'll just pretend. Oh man! I, I just pretend I like I know how to play this instrument. I love the work that you did on the Record like, Brothers album with the mandolin. It's it's beautiful. It's it's. I always I feel like I want to promote the album in that way. It's like, such check a small out Matt's mandolin. I only work. played my total mandolin career was I know, like I know. six months he's max. A, he's I mean. a beginning mandolin player, you know, and, he, and he just shows up on this on this album with this. Oh, and it's just just you just have to check it out. I'm gonna post. I'm gonna post some more stuff. It's, I mean, it's you, been you've before. been playing some violin before then, right? A little, a little bit. bit. Yeah, I think I've been playing See, ever since I moved I, to New Mexico. Ken Luna put a violin in my hand. I was just invited to shower in this place. And I realized that it is not my practice anymore to change my clothes every day, living out of my car. You know, I, I just don't even... That's not how I think. That's not how I live anymore. It's just living in that little car is it's such a challenge. It's, it's uh, you know, getting things... Uh, having a place to do things. It's just a different way of being in this world. Gratefulness. I was just fed, had a couple of pieces of chicken and some mashed potatoes and some corn. And I just played music all day with Matt. So, you know, the music is giving both of us hope today. Thank God. Labor and the expression of worth, aligning our work with our deepest values. Strengthening a tribe member deepens a tribe. Depth tribes feed the world. Travel and Trav and the Transrational Blues. By what standards do we assign value to a human life? What are you worth? And where did you discover your worth? I am the true king, and so are you. Be still and know the I am in yourself. You may want to take these next few moments to breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathing in and breathing out.